guys, it's Maxi, and welcome to part 6 in Sonic Adventure 2 Battle, and we are more or less in the semi-final at this stage of the game, in the hero story. And i just like to quickly note that I kind of backtracked a little bit, and I went back to Tails' first mission, because I got the upgrade, the Laser Blaster, and basically this upgrade, it makes your homing missile stronger for Tails, and the radius of the blast when you hit an enemy is much larger, so it makes it a lot easier when you're targeting enemies and help get a stronger score and all that stuff, and, you know, all the good stuff that we need right now. And especially since we're heading into one of the hardest battle, uh, one of the hardest boss battle fights that includes Tails. So let's continue, and we will find out more straight after this. I'm Sonic. Sonic the Hedgehog. Our plan was perfect. Until Eggman snatched Amy, Eggman said he'll trade us Amy for the Emerald. I have to think about that one. There's no time for jokes. Eggman's ready to fire that weapon again. Tails, Amy, hold on, I'm coming. So Sonic is coming to the rescue to save Tails and Amy because Eggman has got his dirty little hands on them, and he's got a horrible plan, as always, something evil. Even Omo Chow knows stuff like this because he knows everything. And sometimes the things we don't want to know. There are some robots yes, that and that was what I was talking about in the other uh, episode. So I think you're a bit slow on that, Omo Chow. I'm sorry about I caught you out there. But yeah, the artificial chaos. But anyways, we're not here to talk about artificial chaos. We're here to get Tails and Amy. So let's pay a delight to it. Whoa, I won't wait then. That was weird, whatever accent that was. Went a bit Texan y and then probably a bit foreign. But anyway. Let's hit this artificial chaos. Because <laughs> he was in the way of the um, handle. Because we need to elevate up here. And I think this is pretty cool, this uh, thing. And I'm trying to explain. Yeah. See? I think that's pretty cool. High speed cheap thing. Oh, I nearly made that. Come on. There we go. <laughs> I like uh, using the bombs because they just cause loads of destruction and it's just funny to watch the enemies just die from like a sheer wave. It's like, whoa. And I remember that when I was younger, I had a lot of trouble with this stage because I think it was actually really challenging. And especially when this stage gets a lot harder further on. So, yeah. It is a, a very challenging uh, stage for the uh, people that are new to this, so stay toasty. And just follow what I do, basically. <laughs> um, well, not stuff like that, but you know what I mean. Follow the flow of, what I go, of where I go. Oh my god, I nearly died, so that was close. See? See right there? And that thing was very creepy. Just to add that artificial chaos thing. It just gave babies. It gave birth to babies or whatever. Baby artificial chaos. Full start it! There we go. So as you can see, like, through the uh, last part of this, yeah, near the last parts of this game, or more or less in this story, you know the the enemies and stuff. You know the rivals to say, you know they're they're getting into fights right here, so that's starting to get very very interesting and more towards the purpose of um, of the game actually. Like you know Sonic Adventure 2 Battle, because that was, that was you know more or less the aim for this game, and I don't think I was meant to do that. And I can explain why I wasn't meant to do that, because there is a new upgrade, the Flame Ring. This allows you to use a powerful fire assault. So, as you can see right here, I might have skipped the part where it says that you can break iron containers, but basically, yeah, you can break iron containers, like it said. And it makes Sonic look really cool, because um, he's on fire! I'm a fire! That's a good song. <laughs> oh no. Why did I do that? No, what? Oh my god, that was so lucky. 
If I missed that, then I would have been screwed. Because that. Oh god, that was that was just so lucky. And bye bye, bye bye. I've got to stop doing stuff like that. I'm just. I'm basically making myself look really cool just by hitting those things. It's getting a bit annoying. Hello, you ugly thing. So yeah, the the trick for those ugly mother bear things, for those ugly things, is to attack the mother. Because why not? Well, it makes a lot of sense in a way, doesn't it? Kill the mother, and it kills the babies for life. Oh, get away. Can we make this? Yeah! I didn't- oh, okay. I was gonna say, I didn't really- I didn't really get the purpose of that. But if you want to do that, you can basically open that. And open a box. Uh, a chow box, if you want to use it. I don't know, if you want to get the, um, the exclusive animal on this stage. Yes, and that means that it is going to get a lot harder in this time, in this uh, stage. So I can't even get my words right. In this part of this stage, there we go. Well done, Snipe C. The round of applause, but I can't because my fingers are focusing on what I'm doing right now. But anyway, the um, the problem with this stage is that. It can, be, it can get very tricky because you're just moving from place to place, gravity is changing, and I should have jumped right there. Okay, back to this yellow platform. So yeah, things can get tricky, but I'm not trying to distract myself too much because I need to jump, homing attack, there you go. Yeah. So that's another thing, don't get distracted, otherwise you'll lose track of where you are, because Gravity is changing all over the place due to these panels, which is it's bonkers. I'm sorry that I didn't mention that earlier. I must, you know, you must thought, why didn't I? Why didn't Snaxy mention that about the gravity changing? Goodness me! But yeah, that is actually something that's pretty cool about this stage, like with the gravity and all that stuff. But it can get very tricky. But anyways, back to here. Well onto this thing that we haven't really been on the moment. Wait, am I Okay. Okay, it was just a bit of a bit of a um a screen problem. It's fine. So there's something that you definitely want to do and that's to hit that switch. If you don't press that switch, you'll be screwed because you need to use it for something. And I don't know if I have to be here. Oh no it's for the Phoenix, isn't it? Yeah. I think. Or whatever. Oh, okay, for that. Yeah, we don't really need to be here. So anyway, back to there. So definitely hit that switch, because if you could see over there where the goal was, if you have good eyesight, <laughs> well, sorry, not to do, but if you know it very well, then well than you. <laughs> but anyways, you'll notice there's a rocket there, so hit that switch, because the rocket won't appear. So once you're done that. Just use the rocket and be like, boom, I finished the stage, woohoo! And I got a terrible score. <laughs> Funny how I did really good at the easy stages, when it's like much more harder than these ones. Well done me! There we go, gave myself a round of applause because I was able to do it this time. Let's take care of business first, shall we, Sonic? Hand over the Chaos Emerald, slowly, and then we'll talk about your girlfriend. That is, if you really care for her. Handing over the fake Emerald? I can kill two birds with one stone! Put the Emerald down right there and back off. Turned into a big time villain, Doctor. <laughs> Whoa. You 
thought you could trick me with that thing empty, didn't you? So, how did you know it wasn't the real world? Tails! <laughs> because you just told me, Fox Boy. Mind blown. <laughs> oh, a little space ride. The handful clears the colony. Bam! I'm counting on you, Tails. Maybe. Take care of yourself. Farewell, Sonic the Hedgehog. Spirit Tales. And right now, we are heading into a boss battle with Eggman. And this is what I was talking about so eagerly about with the boss. Because it is so hard, you can die so easily on this thing, I'm going to try and avoid that happening. And as you can notice, the, um, oh, sugar missile. That attack's fairly easy to avoid, just keep on running about, just keep running, that's the best thing to do. And as well, another good tactic is you can sneak up behind him, but be careful when he uses this attack because this can take out half of your thing. But, oh no, come on, I can do this, I can do this. No Eggman, this, no, this is the end for you. I'm sorry, this is the end. So there we go, we did it with a hell of a lot of damage put on us, but we did it. Yeah. Just be very careful on that battle on that battle because it it can be very, very crippling. I feel some strange energy. Tails and Amy. I hate to ask, but could you help them? This is our last chance. I got it. the cannon fires, I'll slam dunk it in there. Oh, big showdown. But we'll have to find out in the next episode. I'm sorry I left it on there, but I kind of want to leave it on the cliffhanger just to tease you guys because I know you want to you want to see what's going on you know what's gonna happen right now because it's like oh my gosh what's 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 going on what's going on I mean Sonic just turned up somewhere oh my god but anyway thank you very much for watching leave me a like if you enjoyed give me a comment on what you think right now on this game like what do you think and give me any suggestions or any advice or whatever but anyways I'll see you next time and once again, thank you for watching. So from here on out, bye!